Fox tonight, a family is heartbroken and confused after a 29 year old man was shot and killed in Delwood outside of a local food market last night. Fox News' Michaela McGee sat down with the victim's mother to talk about the tragedy that has left her without her only son, McKay. The victim's name was Sean Moore. He was a father of two and the youngest of four siblings to his mother, Felicia Moore. His death came not even 24 hours after she lost her oldest daughter earlier that morning, and the overwhelming amount of pain and shock has left her numb. It was just shocking. That day was just like horrific and unbelievable and numbing. Two children gone in one day. Her oldest, Talisha, succumbed to her battle with epilepsy at 34 years old. Her son, 29-year-old Sean Moore, shot multiple times in the back, killed in front of a nearby food market. He just went to the store to grab an item and was going to come back, you know, and he didn't make it back. North County Police Cooperative personnel say Moore was shot with a rifle, rushed to the hospital, and later pronounced dead. Just hours before, he was comforting his mother after the loss of his oldest sister earlier that same morning. He kept saying, you're a good mother. We love you. You know, you did everything you could do. Just, you know, don't blame yourself. He just kept, and he just kept hugging me. But he said it throughout that time, but that was the last time. And he scores me so hard. You know, and I love you. His mother, numb and in disbelief. It's the weekend, and I was planning on getting off work and enjoying myself and my kids. So that was kind of horrific and cold hearted to do it on the Easter weekend and do it to somebody didn't know they was coming. And then you didn't know what we was going through. You know, he was already suffering in a little bit pieces and was chipped off and dying because it's his big sister. North County Police Cooperative was able to identify and arrest the suspect Travion Willis Sunday morning around 2.30 a.m. Major Ron Martin, who led the investigation, said, I appreciate the effort of our team assigned to this case. They worked tirelessly throughout the night to ensure we caught the man responsible for the Moore family's suffering. To me, they went above and beyond the cause of duty, and I felt like I was, like, special to them. A motive has not been released in the shooting. And then, you know, to have my baby and my oldest gone, it's just, it's just gonna be a reality. And I'm gonna um, just have to keep putting one foot in front of the other and just rely on my support, because I'm just so glad that I have the support. The family members I spoke with today said that Sean was a loving person with a big heart and an unforgettable smile. He did have two children, small children that he will be leaving behind, but they say that he was an amazing father. Reporting live, I'm Michaela McGee, Fox 2 News.